Hey, I wanted to quickly touch on why I decided to do no moisture treatment or NMT to heal my topical steroid withdrawal. And the main reason is because I wanted to heal as quickly as possible. And I thought that this would be that method. Um, usually the turnaround or the you know average time for healing, it seemed from my research was like three months. It turns out that's not the case for most people, um, and people go on, you know, using this method for years even um, to try and, and heal themselves. And I, I did it for a little over a year myself, um, pretty strictly, <laughs> and I stopped strictly following NMT around this past summer of 2021. And since then, I haven't been doing anything in particular to help with my healing. Um, so no diets and, you know, no treatments or anything like that, just doing my best to live my life. And I want to be very open and, and honest about uh, how difficult this was for me because this was honestly the hardest thing I've experienced physically and mentally and spiritually uh, in my whole life. And, you know, topical steroid withdrawal already as itself is hard, but NMT was the, is the hardest thing I've ever done. And um, don't take that lightly because it is a, a difficult journey and I think everyone has their own method of healing and you're allowed to, to you know, choose whatever method suits you and no matter how long it takes, you know, you don't want to be, I mean, I, you know, I, I, I would want someone to truly tell me how their experience was and for me, it was pretty brutal, you know, it was painful and it was debilitating. So. Do I regret doing it? No, I don't because I learned a lot and I've come a long way since then. Uh, it's It was so humbling. Um, and the craziest part is though, even at this point that I am now, you know, I don't truly know if I can attribute all of my healing right now to NMT. You know, it was it just time? Was it NMT plus time? I don't know. Um, but that's basically why I decided to go for NMT is because I thought that it would be a quick process. But it turns out that it's, it's not but um if there's any silver lining here it's that i i've completely cut out moisturizers from my life and uh i'm really glad about that and i don't want to go back i mean don't get me wrong i'm still pretty dry these days and you know new york city winters man it's crazy but um yeah that's that's me so thank you for listening i love you peace